I am Ashley Johnson. I'm a third year and my major is anthropology. Okay, so anthropology is the study of humans and human ancestors. It's a four subfield approach. So we have cultural anthropology, linguistic anthropology, uh, biological anthropology, and then we have archaeology. And uh, we kind of use all four, but usually people specialize in one. So we use all four to kind of understand um, humans in now and modernity and also human ancestors. I always argue anthropology is everything. You can go into a coffee shop and you can look at how everybody interacts and how everybody's doing um, their own thing and that is anthropology. It's actually culture anthropology. There's like a whole study of like coffee shops or even just uh, if we sat together in a living room. A living room you can study as cultural anthropology like the setting and and how um, you know just how we interact as people and how like what, what the setting has to do with that or you know biological anthropology. You can study anything from diet to you know migration or human ancestors you can study things now in forensics um, you know like people uh, in criminal investigation stuff like that and you know language language we use every day and everything you can study any aspect of language with any sort of part of your life and that's anthropology and then archaeology is you know we use material culture every every single day and everything and you can also study that um, and, and reconstruct you know an entire person's life based off of you know what they leave behind it even in like their garbage you know and and so that's everything is anthropology because you know we are human and we are studying humans <laughs> after I um, started taking anthropology classes I just fell in love with uh, anthropology and the study of people and how broad it is but also how specifically you can study just one little thing in it but it means so much so Wayne State's anthropology program has the best faculty we genuinely have like one of the most diverse faculty and also we have one of the smallest majors at Wayne State so it's very close-knit like you are very comfortable talking to any professor if you especially if you have them but even if you don't you can go up to them talk to them we have events all the time to kind of integrate um, undergraduates, graduates, and the faculty together so that we can uh, really you know, um, use each other as a support system, and I find that that's really awesome for being successful. So there's Roosevelt Park in Detroit, which is a, a site that we excavate uh, every two years, I believe. It was really diverse because people were coming from all over the world to this spot. So they excavate that, and they kind of try to reconstruct um, the life there and how people uh, kind of tried to adapt to living in America and what kinds of traditions they held on to. The archaeology program is a really good connection to Detroit because of this like urban archaeology motive we kind of really try to um, highlight Detroit's history and diversity and how we are you know still diverse today but how we how our foundation for that diversity I do undergraduate research with dr. Julie Lesnick um, we do research on teeth from Peru she excavated a while back after I graduate my goal is to go get my PhD I want to just go straight into my PhD and then after that I'd like to become a professor and do research at a university yeah, but we actually have a program um, at Wayne State called A Grade, and so if you do well, then you can um, participate in it, and you get to do as much as half of your master's in your undergrad. So I am in that program, and I do have enough room to complete that. If you're thinking about studying anthropology, do it. <laughs> um, if you want something that gives you the uh, the choice of what you want to study, if you want something that's really broad, but also you know, it, obviously you have to study humans. But if you want something that gives you that opportunity to really develop your own kind of research and your own thoughts and ideas about the world around you, I would say anthropology is a really good fit um, just because it really, you know, it, it allows you the flexibility and also there's, you know, the tools from each subfield that kind of give you the opportunity to really build your own ideas.